A celebration today at the Salvador Dali Museum. The new modern building is one year old, and not only that, but since it opened, attendance has doubled. Bay News 9's Virginia Johnson is on scene at the Dali and shows us just how much of an impact that renovation has had. In addition to that doubled attendance, we have some other numbers we want to share with you. You might remember that the Dali Museum came with a $36 million price tag. Now, according to the executive director of the Dali Museum, Dr. Hank Hine, they have paid for themselves with more than $50 million in direct spending here in this community as a result of the Dali Museum, plus more than $100 million to the region. Those numbers thrown out at this one-year celebration of the Dali Museum. In addition to that, some big announcements about an avant-garde artist that will be coming here in 2012. The contemporary Dali, the person uh, who shocks, delights, and enchants huge audiences in art, Jeff Koons, is bringing his work for an exhibition at the Dali next October. Uh, it's sensational and it will draw people from all over the world to see this terrific work. Coming up in the 5 o'clock hour, we're going to give you a look at this big celebration, Dolly Mustaches and All. On scene in St. Petersburg, I'm Virginia Johnson for Bay News 9. The Dolly Museum first opened its doors in St. Pete in March of 1982. The original building was 34,000 square feet, and the new one is more than twice that size. And for all things Dolly, be sure to head to Tampa Bay On Demand. That is Channel 340. You'll find a welcome video, a tour, and a look at the gardens and the architecture of the building.